Hello, my people. I want to just take a second and tell you how hitting walls helped me get over my fear. And how fearing nothing, well, I fear God, but, but nothing scares me anymore. And that's why I've accomplished in 26, well, in these past five years. Nothing scares me anymore. I've been through a lot of punishments. I've been through a lot of fallout. I've hit so many walls. I've suffered too many consequences. And playing with fire. And I've been in a lot of trouble. Nothing scares me. But, um, But yes, I'm learning how to listen to my mama and my daddy now. Because I realized the good that I missed out on. Because I realized that I could have hit milestones instead of walls. But I wasn't listening to my mama or my daddy. And out of the four of us, I attend the most church service. I go to church more frequently than they do. You know? I'm just saying. I, I know better. But I didn't care. It, it was basically me turning my back on God, even though I didn't mean to. I realized my actions, despite me saying that I'm a Christian and I believe that... But actions do speak louder than words and how I've treated everyone, how I've treated myself. That you could tell that I had turned my back on God, but I've come back and I've started to listen to my mama and my daddy. You know? It's hard to say, you know, the, the truth. I realized I hit all those walls because I had run from God. And that's why people were running from me. And I really appreciate, I really am grateful. I'm like 10 times more grateful than I was. Because I was so hard-headed that I've hit so many walls, and now I'm learning how to respect and honor my mother and my father, like it says in the Bible, because I've made really bad choices, and I've really messed up by running my mouth when I know I didn't have to. I don't blame... Audrey or Audrey, I honestly don't care that they're never going to give me another chance. I honestly don't give a damn because I have better friends that I know is going to fulfill my needs out there as a friend and that they're going to be my brand new day ones. Besides, every day is day one. I learned that at work. Every day is day one. But yes, I'm going to two different acting workshops so they can give me that discipline. Got to do what they tell me to do. Got to do that. And then that's when I'll get the discipline and when I graduate from both. Mm -hmm. I'll be ready. I have matured. Yeah. I'll, hopefully, you know, I'll make some new friends, you know. Cause I believe this thing is a real, this is a real stepping stone. Whether I'm ready for this or not, God put this out in front of me. I mean, if I hadn't believed all these years, I would have said, screw it, and, and followed the twins to the military. 
or wherever they were, whatever service they did. And we could have still been friends. And we might have still been able to work it out. Because I would have gotten the discipline from there. I would have been like, fuck it, I'm going to, I'm going to serve our country. But my mom is, you know, you know, my mom is kind of overprotective. She gets, she gets very mama bearish. But I believe I need this discipline. I need to learn to do what they tell me to do. So that's why I'm doing these different acting boot camps. God set that out in front of me so I can do his will. And in fact, do the thing that he's personally called me to do, which is acting. He's called me to be out here in the media. Okay. Anyway, I got to go. Catherine, right out there. See you later. Bye.